Hey, what's up everyone? I just want to say how fortunate I am to have had the many blessings, particularly how people just seem to just be in awe over me and just they do things, do so many different things for me. I could go in this place and they'll say, just give him so-and-so or just give him the drink or just give it. I, I, pre, I appreciate that. I mean, it's, it's weird how I just, like tonight, not particularly at one restaurant, that was a bad experience. But the rest of it, I never did like that woman. She never did like us for some reason. She's just very negative. And, uh, Anyway, I uh, I noticed that people will just tell their life stories to me. They'll start opening up to me and talking. And in this one place I was at, this woman was following me around just sharing. And everyone was just, the women and the girls and everyone, they just winked at me and smiled and waved and stuff. And they would follow me around. And I've had so many girls flirt today, so many girls uh, that liked me, which has happened quite a bit lately. Again, it happens It happens in waves where people will just just talk to you and their energy will just their energy will just uh, connect and click and people will just be flirtatious and girls will be flirting and just people will be telling me their stories and just start talking to me. All these, uh, this one girl start woman or girl started telling me about her life stories, about her, uh, the negative relationship she had with her mother and then her, her father and then how, she, how much she loves her children and and she was like, man, like, why the frick am I saying all this? Like, why the heck am I saying all this to you? But she said, I just, it's weird. She said, I, I don't usually open up like that and share, but she did. And I said, oh, that's fine. I'm, I'm, I said, I, I enjoy listening. I said, I'm, I don't mind listening. And she said, oh, thank you. And all the girls in there just, they waved and just smiled and they helped me find different various things and were saying, oh, would you be interested in this? Do you like this? And they just helped me out. And I really appreciated that. It was really nice. And they uh, they usually do that. Or they'll charge everyone for every each individual item, but me they'll just be like This is just this is just whatever. Uh this counts as one item, all of this, and it was there were several items in a in that and it was just it's just I really I greatly appreciate that, the level the extent that people go to treat me kindly everywhere I go, most places that I go. Most uh, people of different backgrounds and and the, in Pilot when I was there, these these Muslims and Hindus everywhere, these uh, Indian people or Muslim and Muslim people, and it's strange how they'll just and even and Christians and everyone they just uh, look at me and like there's something strange and something powerful there, and he just stared at me. This one Muslim guy stared and then he just stared and then went back and tried, oh, the, held the door open. I've had them do a strange bow, like a small a bow. Of, energy um one of them asked are you all right my friend i said yeah i just wasn't feeling too well and he's like okay just want to make sure you're okay and i said thank you and uh that was a couple of weeks ago this and hindus will run to open the door for me even in the pouring rain at these at the gas station and they'll be like are you okay my friend and how are you today and they'll hey, say hey buddy hey buddy and they can sense my energy i, I suppose and just they're just so kind to me and they treat me like royalty many times, and it's just amazing. And certain, certain believers in Jesus Christ will come to me and just, uh, they'll they'll say that I'm supposed to be something very big and and preach and speak and even use the internet to speak things. And no matter how much of a sinner or whatever you do, whatever, he said, I don't know about anything about you, but I know you have a powerful powerful voice and a powerful energy he said i felt the static the electricity the energy in you and he said that was like a messenger or prophet of god and i was thinking and i was i said well thank you he said no don't thank me thank the holy spirit thank the lord that was weeks ago or months ago sorry as well and another person in walmart at that time this being cosmic being i called him he just walked off and then all of a sudden turned his head and turned around to me and smiled and and i said do i know you and he said you know i felt the same thing about you and then he went on telling me about all these different things about the New Age, awakening and ascension and, and all these symptoms and, and awakening symptoms and seeing and hearing things and pains and all these things. That was in 2012. That was experience. I'll never forget. You can find that in that video. But then a couple of years back in Burger King, these people, back when I was wearing this crystal before all my crystals and things disappeared, they said, uh, what kind is that? I said, it's amethyst quartz. And, you know, various people that state, oh, it's evil, it's evil. They don't understand these things fully because it even states in the Bible that... 
uh, that it that these crystals and these stones will be used in the kingdom of heaven, and for their because of their healing properties, because of their divine properties. It states in the very verses that many people tend to overlook overlook that. These stones and crystals will be used in the kingdom of heaven due to their divine properties and connection with God the source, the I am. And uh, just uh, Hamashiach, Elohim, um, Elohim, Hamashiach, Hamashiach Yeshua. Uh, the connection, the connection with the divine is what the, uh, is what these crystals and stones and things have. Which, by the way, I seem to have the crystals in my, um, you know, in my, uh, like the time I have the crystals in my pee. Again, that seems to be happening um, again. And uh, I don't know, but it seemed like it. And I was going to state that when I, whenever people will just look at me in awe, and it could be many other cultures, and they see my energies, and people just treat me with respect, and I treat them with respect. and um. But I don't understand these other cultures that want to destroy and kill everyone. I don't get that at all. I don't know why there are so many Muslims that do that, so many other radicals that do that, or so many extremists even in here, even here in America, even extremist groups of uh, various spiritual or religious groups or whatever these cults I should say, and various extremist groups of Christianity, extremist groups of Islam, extremist groups of all these different groups. You see these extremist groups or. And it's just not, I don't understand why they do that. And I try to be nice to everyone. Sometimes I have to counteract someone's hatred and negativity with uh, sending what I do, or energy. But you have to balance things out sometimes. And, uh, but it's been a good day, very much. And people have given me things again, and that happens quite often. A few days ago, I was, I was at Hardy's again. This guy said, Oh, dang, he said, I should give you the dang thing for, for the having that easy of an order here. And he just gave me the, the drink. I was like, well, the drinks. I was like, thank you. And then, tonight, this girl, she just smiled, and then she was in awe over me for some reason. She almost fell, and I was like, oh, my goodness, I'm so... I'm like, She didn't fall, thank, she didn't fall down all the way, though, thankfully. She waved at me, and then that happened as we were driving off. But she gave, she said, here, this is on us. And I said, well, thank you. And we've had the fortunate uh, for, fortunate event of people paying for our meals three times this year or this summer. They were just out of the blue. They stated they did that. And this girl and woman, her girl and a mother, her mother, that they, they like me. They paid for both of our meals and our desserts and everything that we were taking home from this restaurant. And... Um, yeah, I've had good fortune this week. It's been a good week. And except for one event, that one event I mentioned, I mentioned in my previous video, but hopefully my energy counteracted that. And people have been just looking at me. A lot of girls have been looking at me, flirting, flirtatious, and just people just been in awe and kind of, you know, just uh, stating things to me. And um, whoever I'm around, I send, I seem to just blend to, and people just will just give things and be nice. And it's just... Uh, like, here, here's this, don't worry about this, don't worry about that. I mean, it's just, uh, hopefully that continues. May the Lord let that continue because, you know, only by God's blessings is it so. Whatever I am, whatever I'm supposed to be, I appreciate the blessings that I'm given, and I do appreciate it. I, uh, I've got to always stop and give thanks for those I mean, I, I always use energy to bless my food, energy bless my food, and um, let Lord bless this food for digestion. I do that. Put my hand over the food and wave the energy and bless the food for digestion. And I, just like many other people, are trying to figure this whole thing out, and we don't really understand and know fully the whole thing and what things are and what's going on, but... We're trying to we're trying to figure it out and find our place in this crazy world. I feel like I'm supposed to lead. I'm supposed to be my own in my own way, and not necessarily just follow the norms of everything, but just somehow or other be independent in my own way, do my own thing, but have a leadership and connect many, unite many people, and 
take down a lot of darkness and evil, counteract and balance. And But the way this world is, it's difficult to do the way they keep things down and they want to keep things that way. But maybe I feel the Lord will use me for something, no matter what. I mean, look at various people in the mentioned in biblical text and the historical stories and and parables and things that were given. Look at King David. Look at uh, um. Look at the story of Joseph. Look at um. Look at the story of David and Goliath and how he was chosen to slay the giant. There are so many stories that relate to someone that God has chosen. And um, I feel like I'm supposed to do something very, very important, very powerful, very, 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 very important. And maybe I'll find out what that is someday. And uh, balance things out, find the right person, find the right... I mean, I haven't been with anyone, but maybe I'll find the right person and maybe I'll, uh, I love God, I love my parents, and I love you all, and I just, um, want things to balance out, but I just wanted to share how many strange and unusual blessings tend to happen to me. They might not happen forever, but so far, I'm thankful, and, um. I send love. Peace. Much love. God bless. Peace, everyone. Signing out. If you'd like to show your love and support and you like my message and what I do, the link to PayPal is below, as well as the link to my email, or at least the email will be listed below, for this channel. I'm trying to figure Patreon out. I created a Patreon. Not sure how it works yet. I'll put it below at some point. I have in a few previous videos, but I'm still looking and working on that. I don't really know what I'm doing with it yet. But the PayPal and email for this channel will both be below. Peace, everyone. Signing out. Sending love. Thank you to those who have supported. God bless.